I'm going to teach you a recipe that you can buy in the jar off the grocery shelf, but why would you buy something in the store when you can make it homemade? Now, my teenage son will give a grocery store version about a five. It's good. It does the job. But a homemade version of this recipe, he gives a 13 out of 10. So let's go into my kitchen. I'm going to teach you from experience a tried and true recipe that my kids love, and it is Alfredo sauce. Tastes delicious. It's Carrie here, and this is Cooking with Carrie. Welcome to my kitchen. If you're brand new here, I'm so excited that you're here, and I hope that you'll hit the subscribe button so that you'll miss any of my other videos. Each week, I turn common kitchen and pantry ingredients into good food for you and your family to enjoy. We'll be creating a simple meal that's easy to make and tastes great. So make sure you hit the subscribe button and click the little bell so that you get notified and won't miss any of these great videos when they come out. Today we're making fettuccine alfredo with alfredo sauce from scratch. Nothing tastes better than a creamy alfredo sauce. So I'm gonna take you over the stove top and we're going to make that alfredo sauce together. Let's get cooking. Our alfredo sauce starts with two tablespoons of butter melted over medium heat. Once melted, add one tablespoon of flour. Then mix to create together to create a white sauce. When someone says creating a white sauce, what it means is to bring the butter and the flour together till it's bubbly like so. Once we've reached this, we're going to add our two cups of milk. Today I'm using cream. Next, add a half a cup of Parmesan. Mix in. An eighth a teaspoon of pepper. An eighth a teaspoon of salt. A quarter teaspoon of basil. And last but not least is one teaspoon equaling one clove of garlic. Those are all the ingredients. It's as simple as that. Now all we need to do is wait for this to come to a boil and thicken. Meanwhile, while that's happening, I'm going to boil my linguine or fettuccine noodles in a large pot of wa water as per the instructions on the package for the pasta. Hey, look at that thick, creamy Alfredo sauce. Bubbling beautifully. It's so thick that it's got a really slow boil on it, but it is done. I'm going to pour that on top of the pasta noodles and we're ready to eat. Look at that quick, easy dinner. And that's how you make homemade Alfredo sauce. Hope that you and your family enjoy. If you enjoyed this video, click the like button and subscribe so you stay up to date with more great dinner ideas and desserts on Cooking with Carrie. Enjoy!